So this is looking at the solution for the Desmos activity, make them balance. And this is the solution to slide number 10. We're given this particular balance and we're asked to solve for X and Y. If we look at this, we have two hangers. We have what we would say the top hanger and we have the bottom hanger. We're gonna work from the bottom up in order to solve this. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look at the equations that I have for both of these hangers. This bottom hanger, because these two are equal, says that my two X's equal these four Y's. So I write an equation that says two X equals four Y. When I look at this top hanger, what I have is that I have three X's and three threes, which is three X plus three times three, is equal to what I have on this right hand side, which is two X's and four Y's. So I've set up this equation to represent the entire mobile. Because I'm working from the bottom up, what I look for is this equation is involving my X's. So I wanna make sure that I am using only my X variables. I can do that by manipulating this bottom hanger. I know that two X's equals four Y. So what I wanna do is figure out, well, what does one Y equal? Because I wanna substitute. In this particular case, if I divide both sides by four, I'll find out that Y is equal to one half X. And again, all I'm doing is dividing by four. Divide by four here, divide by four here. So now I know what my Y is equal to. So now I can go back over to my top and say I have three X plus three times three is equal to two X plus four Y. So what I'm gonna do now that I know what Y is, is I am going to substitute. So I am taking Y and I am substituting this value for y. So y becomes one half x. So when I solve this and I simplify it, what I get on the left hand side stays as 3x plus 9. And on this side, my 2x stays the same. When I multiply 4 times one half x, I get 2x. So now I have the equation 3x plus 9 equals 2x plus 2x. Combining like terms on the right hand side, what I get is 3x plus 9 is equal to 4x. And then I solve and I subtract 3x from both sides, I get that 9 is equal to x. Now that I know what my value for x is, I can now go back and substitute that into this equation and figure out what y is. So I'm going to substitute x equals 9. So that gives me 1 half times 9 equals y. When I do the math here, what I get is that y is equal to 4.5. So now I know that these x's are equal to 9 and the y's are equal to 4.5 and, and the mobile will balance.